welcome to my home. So today I'm going to show you how I created this swag for our front door. I mean, isn't it gorgeous? I love how you can make such a big impact with very little time, uh, low cost, and just a few simple steps. I mean, and the best part is most of it you can find in nature, maybe even your backyard. So come with me and let's get creative. So really, you're only going to need about three branches, although I think two would also work. You're going to start with one really nice sturdy branch, and then I have two that are a little bit softer, and then we'll just use those to layer. And then we'll need some, some pine cone and something red. I picked these berries, um, and then we'll need some wire wire snips, and to finish it off, we'll need some ribbon. So if you're anything like me, um, I don't like this um, bald spot here, so I am going to take another branch and just kind of wire it in to give it more of a, a full teardrop shape. So just take a piece of wire and just wrap it around nice and tight. The next thing you want to do, you want to flip it upside down and then take um, a wire and put a, put a hook on it. This is what you're going to use to hang it on your door afterwards. So you're just going to wrap it around a couple times and just secure it real good. And then see, that's what we'll use to hang it on. So flip it over. Wire. And we're going to lay that on the back side and then we can start layering our different branches and really this is where you use your imagination just whatever you find that looks best to you you want to be able to lay them out so that you can see all three of them and then you want to take your wire and wrap it around and you want to make sure you go really nice and tight. As the branches start to dry out, the branches will start to shrink and then fall out. So you want to wrap it for all your work. Then we'll take our pine cones and I've cut a piece of piece of wire. You don't need a very long piece, just enough to wrap around. You want to create kind of like a, a fold stem, just something that you're going to use to attach to the branches. So then once you have that, you want to kind of lay them out where you're going to be able to attach them to, to your sway. And you can kind of decide, do you want three or do you want more? I'm going to keep it simple, I'm going to go with three. Then you do the same with your berries, you'll put a wire on. And again, just arrange them however you want. And put on as many as you want. It's your swag, so you can get creative and make it yours. Then we'll just take our pine cones with the wire on and just find the branch that you want to attach it to and wrap it around nice and tight. Now we can get our ribbon and you kind of want to see about how long you want your tail. And then just grab your ribbon and make loops and pinch it. We're just going to go with a simple bow. Just go back and forth. Of course, it is easier just using one ribbon, but I'm 
always have to make things difficult and go a little more. And just go back and forth, making loops. Leaving a nice long tail for the other side. Then you'll use a piece of wire and just wrap that nice and tight. You want to make sure you get enough, keep enough to enough wire in the back to attach it to the top of the swag after. Thank you so much for joining me. I hope you also enjoyed the 